Planet Zoo has been rated E10 plus by the ESRB for crude humor, mild blood, and mild violence. It is generally suitable for people age 10 years and up. Hey folks, this is Jack. Welcome back to the zoo. <clears throat> Excuse me. I seem to have got a, what do what they used to say, a frog in my throat or whatever? Anyway, welcome back to the zoo. This is the Wadanungu Wildlife Preserve. Um, what we're going to do, or what I'm hoping to do in this episode, is add a habitat for the nine-banded armadillo. Um, I was thinking about putting it right over here. Should work out just fine. In the meantime, though, I want to uh, look and see if there's anything that we need to handle. Yeah, we can release him to the wild. Okay, uh, offspring. And he's matured also we can release him to the wild nothing really else I mean I think we handled the fighting among the warthogs already um, but we do have an, a VIP molecular biology this is molecular biology young lady I'm presuming young lady if I have just misgendered you I apologize so we'll say hello and there's Puppy 310. This is Puppy 310. Another young lady. And again, if I'm misgendering you, I apologize. I'm just working on appearances. And we got 20 from there. Whoops, nope. Can't have that. Can't have that. You're going on birth, on birth control. Now, when you say... Who are your parents? Your parents, unknown father and unknown mother. What are you, brother and sister? Oh my gosh, they're siblings. Oh gosh, we can't have that. Hold on. Yeah, you gotta go, baby. You gotta go. I gotta send you somewhere else. I'm gonna release you to the wild. And then we're going to get a, uh, a female rednecked wallaby. that is not related to our male redneck wallaby, and there aren't any. How about that? Okay, hmm, interesting. <clears throat> All right, well, we'll just have to do one female down. Anyway, uh, yeah, we've already talked to our VAPs. We've got everything set. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start the build on this, um, on this habitat. Now let's get the Australia theme and we're going to turn off those so All right. All right. This is, uh, of course, going to be the uh, the zookeeper support building. Not really going to be putting much in here except for a uh, uh, yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Except for a keeper set. <clears throat> I think that's going to be enough. Is that going to be enough? Oh, no. I, sometimes this game just does not want to cooperate with anybody and it's a little ridiculous doing so. crying out loud. You see what it's doing? I'm trying to move it down and it's like, no, no, we're going to move out. 
I don't want it to move out. And it's too low too. Look at this. Look at this. It's not uh, uncooperative piece of crap. Wait. I have no idea why it was doing that. I really don't. But it was being irritating. Very irritating. Okay. I don't need the ring to be that big. And I just need to um, flatten a little. Go down a little here. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys, for constantly trying to clear my throat. And I want, um, I want one of these. Okay, that works. And then we'll bring this rock over just a little so it closes there. All right. Perfect, perfect. Let's put some roof on this. See this? Uncooperative. The game is just being uncooperative to be uncooperative because it's it's just being ornery. That's all it's doing. There we go. And I haven't even started on the actual habitat yet. That's that's going to be in a minute. Um, it's going to be pretty good though, I think.
Okay. <clears throat> We're back to the Australia theme. Oh wait, you know what? Instead of that, let's use this. There we go. That works. That works pretty much. Alright, let's look at the barriers. This is not going to be an overly huge um, enclosure because, to be honest, the, the armadillos just don't need that much room. So... over some like that. Is that a straight line do you think? That's almost a straight line, right? Almost. Okay. Now this rock I'm going to actually turn a little like this. And we're gonna bring it in. So it instantly basically it instantly forms the far uh, the far barrier. See that the, the fence is actually inside that rock, so that's a good thing. Now, <clears throat> if you hear any banging, that's, uh, that's from my neighbor's dogs. They are still at it, believe it or not. Just put these over here like so and hope I got the straight line right <laughs> all right there we go uh, one there one there and one there hey look I got it I got it it's it's that's pretty much perfect that's exactly what I wanted now uh, let me see something here. What do we got? Aust Australia theme. And let's remove the word glass and we get all this number. Now, no, we want thin, like this. Okay. Uh, let's put on the angle snap so we can go one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we'll bring it over here and down and then end so it basically covers up the low the lower edge of that window I don't know what's a little look with a large one that's a little clunkier but it covers up better don't you think yeah let's let's just bring it down a little bit more though like so like that and then we'll bring this one here and uh, one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and then we'll bring it out here so it's kind of like that you know doing a little mix up with the colors there and then another one we'll just bring it all the way around I don't need to count it out every time Yeah, 
yeah that's perfect that's absolutely perfect now um okay you know what i need though not this i need the smaller one that i was looking at this one Five, six, okay. Like that. What do you think? Yes, I like it. We're about to have wallaby babies again. That's a good thing. Oh yeah, look at this. This is just great, isn't it? That's just perfect. Now let's I wanna I wanna check on something here. Okay, let's go to what are we doing? Eight wide right now? Is that what we really is that how wide we are? Yes it is. Wow, that's gigantic, but I guess it works. Yeah, I like that. That nice curve of the path, that's brilliant. I love it. Okay, now um, let's put the barriers up, or the barriers are already up. Let's put the door up so that we know. Right, 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 of course. This is gonna be difficult because it's just gonna be difficult. Okay, let's get rid of the path. Facilities, habitat, barriers. Okay. That, that does it for the path. Let's get rid of this path, and then what we'll do is we'll... Um, and that's not going to connect. Of course it's not going to connect. Why would it connect? It's... Uh, connecting there would just be too easy, wouldn't it? There, that's it. It's it's done. It's it's messy, but it's under the cover of the building, so I guess it won't really matter. Not that much. You see the terrain. I want to give them a slight hill. slight hill like that just a little one doesn't have to be that that big in fact uh, the habitat all right what we're gonna do nine I, I hope this habitat's big enough Okay, the, bill's a, the, the, the hill's a little bit bigger than I expected, but that's all right. Let's get our armadillos. Violetta and Fernando. Okay, and this is the armadillo habitat. I'm hoping it's big enough. I really am. We shall see. Put a food bowl down 
right here. And we'll go get a water pipe. We're not gonna have a lot of room for a lot of plants and such, but that's all right. Yeah, I like this one. All right, there we go. Let's smooth this out a little. Yeah, that works. That works even better. Okay, nature biome is grassland, I think, and continent is North America. See if I can't find a nice tree that would work in here that doesn't like over dominate. I think trees are more like bushes. Yeah, way too big for what I was thinking. And there's always a cypress. Oh hey, yeah, we gotta. We'd better turn unpause the game because they, if we don't, we're never gonna get our animals in here. not putting a redwood in this. No, that, that would just be ridiculous. Okay, and this is Fernando. I need to ink, oh my God, we were only off by two feet. Can you believe that crap? All right, well, there's an easy way to fix it. An easy way to fix it, and here's how. What we do is we do this, we make a copy, bring it down that way, okay? Then we take these rocks, and we pull them out just a touch, like so, and, uh, we we'll bring them straight down and then curve them in just a touch like that. And just bring them in again. All right. And then. The law of the jungle, as old and as true as the sky. The forest protected shall prosper. The forest neglected shall die. Even aptitude to change attitudes, cause we have to prove it. Let's ride it to grab your shovel. Let's work to do the world's in trouble. You gotta build.